This tip I'm going to show you here is a great way to trace or create a boundary using a couple different line segments and quickly trace them. So what I need to do is I need to create a boundary that follows this contour line, follows the top back of curve, and closes back at the uh, start point. And I can either you know sit here and trace this and connect all the dots, get it close, or I can simply use the append track command. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to create a line string. I'm going to put it on a, a give it a name, put it on a layer, and we'll click OK. So I'm going to start my line at this point over here on this contour. I'm just going to pick this as a starting point. I'm then going to go up to the append track line command. It's going to ask me for the line I want to append. I'm going to pick this contour line. And it's going to ask me for a start point and an end point. Now I'm just going to pick this first segment of this contour line. I could actually pick the start point as well. And now it's asked me for the end point. You can see that my cursor is tracing that contour line. And I don't want to go all the way to the end. I want to go maybe about to the midpoint in here somewhere. So let's say I pick this point here. Then it's going to stay in that append track command. It's going to ask me for another line to append. And I can either just cancel out of that and just start drawing or pick the top back of curb you have here. Click this as my starting point. It's going to draw a line from that point to this point. And then I'm going to pick the end point back over here where I'm just going to pick the start point. You can see it draws that line all the way over to there. And if I just use the auto close by closing this, clicking auto close, now I have a closed shape that I can use for maybe an area of interest. I can use it to determine uh, maybe volume in this area. I could use it for maybe adding a hatch pattern. You name it. Um, if I just want to know what the area is of that, I can pick that line string, right click on it, go to properties and I can check out the area of that particular segment. So very quickly using the append line command I can or append track command I can quickly draw a boundary for multiple objects within my project.